is given 2 divided by square root of 2 minus 1 to the whole power 6 is equal to what? So, we have to find out the value of this term. Let's see solution. How we can find out the value of this term? 2 divided by square root of 2 minus 1 to the whole power 6. This is question. So, we can do here one thing. Here square root of 2 minus 1, right? Let's consider square root of 2 minus 1. Square root of 2 minus 1 is equal to x, mm -hmm. right? If we are considering this one, square root of 2 minus 1 is equal to x. So, we can say square root of 2 is equal to x plus 1, right? Now, here x power 6. This is x. So, x power 6 is equal to square root of 2 minus 1 to the whole power 6, mm -hmm. right? Now, this is equation number 1. You can say this is equation number 2 and this is equation number 3. Now, x plus 1 is equal to square root of 2. So, we are taking this one. x plus 1 is equal to square root of 2. Now, we can uh, take here square on both sides. Taking square on both sides then we will get x plus 1 whole square is equal to square root of 2 whole square right now this square is cancelled from square root so here x plus 1 whole square a plus b square a plus b whole square uh, square formula is a square plus b square plus 2ab so here x square plus 2x 2ab right 2x plus b square that is 1 equal to this is 2 so we can write this one x square plus 2x plus 1 minus 2 is equal to 0 now we got here one equation that is x square plus 2x plus 1 minus 2 is minus 1 equal to 0. Now, we can say here, therefore, x square is equal to 1. This will become positive in RHS. So, 1 minus 2x. Right? This is the value of x square. This is question number, sorry, question number 4. Right? This is question number 4. Now, this is x square equal to 1 minus 2x. Again, we have to take a square of this number. So, if we are taking a square of this number, so x square whole square is equal to 1 minus 2x whole square. Right? Taking square on both sides. Then we will get here x power 4. x power 4 is equal to. Now, this is a minus b. a minus b whole square. So, a minus b whole square is a square plus b square minus 2ab. Right? So, here a square that is 1 minus 2ab. 2ab is 2 times a that is 1 times 2. 4. 2 to the 4 minus 4x plus b square. b is 2x. 2x whole square. Right? Now, x power 4 is equal to 1 minus 4x plus 2 to the 4 and this is x square, 4x square, right? Now, x power 4 is equal to 1 minus 4x plus 4. Now, this is x square, right? So, according to equation 4, you can see x square is equal to 1 minus 2x. So, we have to substitute this value of x square, one minus, uh, x square is equal to 1 minus 2x here. So, we can write this 1 minus 2x. This is the value of x square, right? From You can mention here from equation 4. Now, 1 minus 4x plus 4 times 1 minus 2x. So, we can simplify this. x power 4 is equal to 1 minus 4x plus. Now, 4 times 1. 4, uh, 1 is 4. 
minus 4 to the 8 minus 8x. Now it will become x power 4 is equal to 1 minus. Now here minus 4x minus 8x. 12x. So we can write this minus 12x plus 4. Right. Now we can say value of x power 4. Value of x power 4 is equal to 1 plus 4 is 5. So 5 minus 12x. This is equation number 5. This is equation number 5, right? Now, we have to multiply. Multiply equation 4 and 5. Now, equation 4, you can see this is equation 4. X, uh, x square is equal to 1 minus 2x. And equation 5 is x power 4 equal to 5 minus 12x. We have to multiply these two equations here. So, x square we can write this x square times x power 4 is equal to value of x square is 1 minus 2x and x power 4 is 5 minus 12x 5 minus 12x now x power 2 times x power 4 is equal to x power 2 times 4 here it will become plus so 2 plus 4 is 6 x power 6 is equal to now 1 times 5 minus 12x second bracket minus 2x times 5 minus 12x now therefore we can say x power 6 is equal to 5 times 1 is 5 minus 1 times 12 12x 5 minus 12x minus 2 times 5 5 to the 10 minus 10x minus minus plus 12 to the 24 24x square right now is equal to we can write this one 5 minus 12x minus 10x minus 12x minus 10x 22 so minus 22x plus 24x square therefore we can say x power 6 is equal to 24x square minus 22x plus 5 this is value of x power 6 so uh, here 24x square right uh, and we already know that value of x square equal to 1 minus 2x according to equation so according to equation 3 uh, value of x square is equal to 1 minus 2x sorry uh, this is equation 4 according to equation 4 value of x square is equal to 1 minus 2x right so we have to substitute this value here this is you can say equation number 6 so we have to substitute this value in equation 6 therefore x power 6 is equal to 24 x square x square is 1 minus 2x minus 22x plus 5 is equal to 24 times 1 that is 24 minus 24 to the 48 so 48x minus 22x plus 5 now is equal to 24 minus minus it will become minus so 8 plus 2 is 10 0 4 plus 2 6 plus 1 7 minus 70x plus 5 now we got the value of x power 6. x power 6 is equal to, here it will become 24 plus 5, that is 29. So 29 minus 70x. This is value of x power 6. You can see this is the value of x power 6. But according to uh, equation what, uh, whatever given, we already considered that x is equal to square root of 2 minus 1 right we already considered this value in beginning so we can say therefore x power 6 is equal to 29 minus 70 and value of x is square root of 2 minus 1 so here it will become square root of 2 minus 1 now x power 6 is square root of 2 minus 1 value of x is square root of 2 minus 1 and this is power 6 is equal to 29 
माइनस सेवेंटी सेवेंटी स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टू माइनस वन नाउ वी हैव टू सॉल्व दिस वन सो वी विल गेट हेयर ट्वेंटी नाइन माइनस सेवेंटी स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टू सेवेंटी स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टू स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टू माइनस सेवेंटी टाइम्स हेयर माइनस वन सो इट विल बिकम प्लस सो प्लस सेवेंटी राइट नाउ स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टू माइनस वन पावर सिक्स इज इक्वल टू नाउ ट्वेंटी नाइन प्लस सेवेंटी इट विल बिकम नाइन हेयर एंड सेवन प्लस टू नाइन नाइन्टी नाइन माइनस सेवेंटी स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ टू Now this is the value of square root of two minus one power six is equal to ninety nine minus seventy square root of two. But actual question is given two power square root of two minus one to the whole power six, right? So is equal to we can write this two power six divided by square root of two minus one to the power six, right? We can write this way. Now two power six, two power six is sixty four. Divided by square root of two minus one power six. Square root of two minus one power six is ninety nine minus seventy square root of two. So ninety nine minus seventy square root of two. We got this value. So we can say is equal to sixty four ninety nine minus seventy square root of two. Now we have to multiply with conjugate pair of this number because we have to simplify this one, this denominator. Mm -hmm. So we can multiply with conjugate pair, pair of denominator, denominator. Then we will get is equal to sixty four times conjugate pair of this number is ninety nine plus seventy square root of two. Divided by ninety nine minus seventy square root of two. This one and conjugate pair of this number is ninety nine plus seventy square root of two. Right? Now uh, is equal to. We can write this one sixty four times ninety nine plus seventy square root of two divided by. Now this is a minus b times a plus b, so it will become a square minus b square formula here. So a square is a is ninety nine ninety nine square a square minus b square minus b square is seventy square root of two to the whole square is equal to. When we solve this one, this term ninety nine square minus seventy square root of two, we will get here value one. So we can say sixty four. Times ninety nine plus seventy square root of two divided by one. Value of this is this one is one. Now we uh, we can say uh, question is uh, two times square root of two minus one to the whole power six is equal to. We got this value sixty four times ninety nine plus seventy square root of two. Or second value we can say when we multiply this term we will get here sixty four times ninety nine then we will get here six thousand three hundred thirty six plus when we multiply this one with seventy uh, then we will get here four thousand four hundred eighty square root of two. So in this way we got here two value. First one you can say sixty four times ninety nine plus seventy square root of two. Our next one is six thousand three hundred thirty six plus four thousand four hundred eighty square root of two. So this is the solution for this number. Thank you.